Hello everyone, hello, hello, welcome back to another video. So today, okay, now turn the memes, okay, welcome back to another video. Today, I'll be doing a PvP tutorial, PvP tips and tricks. I'm not sure how I'm gonna call it yet. Uh, so yeah, I guess you'll see in the title. But yeah, we're in the Mayman Club, and let me disguise real quick. Uh, depending on how much support this video get, I'll do more important stuff as to how to win almost every ranked match. So, first uh, tutorial is gonna be how to pot. So, let me queue unranked. I might queue ranked after or not, so I can like do a better demonstration with the, someone good. Uh, basically, what I do when, when I pot is like I try to pot on to splash only once. Like, when you want to pot conserve it, when you want to pot conserve, you don't want to double splash. Or, like, even if you double splash, do it like once. Don't do it more than once. Like, try not to do it once. And try and like, when you pot, try to get as close to full. Like, don't pot in one heart, because that's like literally stupid. Like, see, now I'm at eight hearts. I'm basically pot conserving right now. So, if anyone tells you to double all the times just to go for the trades, then that's praying us. That's just stupid. Like, literally. Okay, what? This kid is getting railed. Holy. So, yeah, try not to be try to be careful when you pot. Like, don't pot at 7 hearts. It's always over 6. Like, pot at 4 or 5. So you can go at 8 or 9 hearts. That's the preferred amount. Okay, yeah. So, you don't even need to aggro like this. Like, if you manage not to get combo, then you only manage to trade. What? <laughs> what? Okay, let me get an out real quick. So, as I was saying, uh, you don't even need to aggro or, like, try to out-hit the opponent when you do this. Since, if you don't, if you manage not to get comboed, then, like, you just like, win the fight. Because, like, if you trade and the other guys in pot conserving, and you are, then you, have, then you end up having more pots. And by out-hit, I mean, like, if, he, if the opponent has, like, two or three more hits, I guess you think you'll still be able to like bid them depending on how they pot. Like see this kid here, this kid is out hitting me right now. And I missed the pot in the wall, but that's not a that's not a problem. Like actually that's not a problem. Just try to make up for it by conserving the rest. And like try to pull down near you're close to being full. Now I'm out hitting this guy. Now I'm gonna pot. And I was just like seven and a half hearts there. I'm at a seven. And see, I have the advantage now since he needs to refill. Now I'm at eight. Keep potting the more I could try to go full. And now I double pot it at two hearts. Since I was about to pot in peril. Like, if you want to pot in peril and do stuff like that, then just. I feel like I'm winning this, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, this guy's getting railed now. Okay, what? Okay, what? There's a panel wave as well. Dude, that combo was so good. Hamzy got banned. Wow. Like, I haven't even been playing that much aggro. Like, I only hit him, but, like, I, I'm not trying to, like, outspeed him. I'm trying to play faster than him. And that's, like, another thing that you need to do when you pull. You don't try to rush, okay? Especially if you have hyping like me. Like, don't try to pause as, to pot as fast as you can. Don't try to play fast. Take a moment and concentrate. Otherwise, you're going to miss. Like, when I do that, like, when I start playing fast and I miss all of my pots, it's all about concentration. And I could have been wrong about the amount of pots that I'll beat this guy with. Okay, is he out yet? No. Okay, what? He's out now. And just like that, I won. And I have a 3-speed kit as well. Okay, he just happened to be in the video. There you go. No potting idol. <laughs> okay. Cold Eyes. This seems like a disguised name. So, just try to do this. Okay, there I hit it fully. If, it, if you mix that with 100 pot accuracy, then you basically won the fight. Also, another thing to take to keep in mind is to like... When you're low and like, or like when you're almost full, don't pot, okay? If, you, if you're far away from the opponent and you're playing on a server where people actually move, for example, MMC, then just run a bit and reason. Like, not now, but like later when you have the time and the space to do that. 
Okay, look. I hit my three hearts, but I don't mind. Even if you miss it barely, it doesn't matter. And this kid all supported me, so that's a good thing. Okay, I'm, I ran out of hunger. So this guy's just gonna aggro me now. Which isn't a bad thing at all, to try to reason the amount of health you lost. Like, don't drink the speed immediately. Once he gets close, drink the speed. This is also like a tip on how to win drag. But okay, you gotta appreciate this, okay? And uh, I'm now not spending a pot for no reason. I'm getting back the health I lost there. And like, speed isn't a matter for me, so I can just do that. Now I'm at 7 hearts without potting. And if you're at 7 hearts or above, then that's a good uh, starting point. Like, try to go for it, say, 7 hearts and above whenever you pot. Or whenever you reason. And, and pot it like 4 hearts or 3. When you, when you pot it 2 hearts or 1, and you want to like, pot in peril. Or like, trade with the opponent. For example, when you're fighting someone who doesn't move. Then double pot there. Like, don't do it all the time though. Because that will lead you to getting like a pot if you double pot the whole fight. Okay. Okay, see? Like right there, I wasn't trying to outspeed the opponent, I still got it. And like, and that's another thing. Like, if your opponent keeps double potting, they keep wasting more pots in their hotbar. If you like sp spas once and you do it at its correct timing. Then your opponent will run out of pots in their hotbar faster, which means then you can aggro them. Of course, that means that you won't have to, that you, that you don't have to get comboed. Because like, if you get comboed, then you're fucked. Literally. What? When we can get the Mime and Clive? Okay, what? I think that guy asked the staff when the club, when club client is releasing. How many pots? Nine. Now we killed almost one point kill. I think this will be the last fight of this video. I don't want the videos to be too short, but I don't want them to be too long either. So this guy has a parasite skin, which makes me worry. Just from his name, he seems Italian. I could be wrong though. <laughs> He's of the Baxelli. Okay, I missed the pot there, but no, no worries. Now this guy's gonna try to like outspeed me, okay? When someone tries to do that, don't go for the combo. Just go for the trades. Trade and I don't have... Oh, that guy got banned. I mean, he was sitting, so not my problem. Okay, so I'm gonna do one more since that guy was sitting. And I idle again, for real. I mean, okay. <laughs> That's a good example, I suppose. So, uh, if you know idle, he plays very really fast, okay? So, the secret to beating idle is basically try to conserve your pots. Try not to get combo as well. Okay, I might have to sweat a bit, or actually no, I'm just a bit worried. Okay, there we go. He has carrots, which is a disadvantage for him. Okay, like this strategy actually worked against Idle once, I beat him with half a heart and he had like 10 more hits, or 20, I don't remember, it was an MMC as well, it was like last season, okay she just potted somewhere and I think he potted me a bit, yeah try to go for the trades, okay, he's not gonna let me hit, I mean that's his problem. Look how I'm playing slower and I'm still keeping up with him. When you're playing like this, you shouldn't try to like play faster than your opponent. Try to keep up with your opponent actually. Okay, so that's why I play differently against depending on the opponent. If the opponent plays faster, I'll try to keep up with him. I'll play a bit faster. If the opponent plays slowly, then I'll play slowly. Okay. Got a simple, nice combo there. Wasn't too long though. Okay. That bottom parallel there, right there was so clean. I'm not gonna lie. And I hit him there at the end too. Okay. 
I don't have many pots left, but I might be a bad thing, but he's in the corner. Okay, he's not anymore. Okay, I drank that speed there just for safety purposes. Okay, got that combo on him. Okay, that was a huge combo, I'm not gonna lie. And I think I won, honestly. Yeah, I won. He had 100% per accuracy, I had 100% per accuracy as well. And I won. <laughs> okay, I wasted half a heart though, but he wasted one and a half. But I still won, and I was like full, I think. I was five and a half, anyway. No hate title, he's like really good. This is just how I PvP. I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll do more if this gets enough support, as I said. So, yeah, bye.